So we're stopping by one of my clients just closed on a home and they're not ready for the winter. So we're gonna get it together, show you the before and after, just making sure their best interest is covered because single parent lady, the last thing we need is for this to bust and we have a bigger problem. We keep you posted. Okay, so as you see, we got everything taped up. Everything's ready to go. This is the shutoff valve for the water coming in. And this is the shutoff valve for the water going out. So the first thing we're gonna do is turn off both of these valves. That's off right there. And that's off right there. So after you do that, on some of them, you have plastic caps right here. You want to take those plastic caps off and you want to open these bleeder screws right here a half a turn and you'll see the water pressure comes out. Now some people use the flathead screwdriver. And that's just the pressure from the line and it's coming out. Get it all the way off there. You can see that water's starting to shut off. The pressure's releasing. You want to open the bottom one as well. Now don't try this at home with a knife, like me. I'm crazy. <laughs> but it's my knife I got from my daddy, so. I value this knife. I keep it close to me at all times. Now that releases all the pressure in the line. We shut it off here. We shut it off there. So once that finished draining, all you're going to do is leave those valves open. And then you're going to shut the water off to a 45. You're going to open it to a 45, which will let the rest of the pressure from the sprinklers back out. That was the pressure that you seen coming back from the sprinklers going back. So we're gonna leave this one shut off. We're gonna leave this one at a 45 and that drip will stop. And then once that stops, everything is finished. But when you're ready to start back, all you do is open this line parallel with the pipe and you open this line parallel with the pipe and you'll be perfectly fine. So everything has been taped up. Everything has been anchored. That's your video on how to secure your water sprinklers for the winterizing. Thank you.